Hey guys, Drew with GeoArm and I'm back with the brand new 2 gig Edge and I'm going to talk to you about getting your user codes programmed. Uh, super easy, this panel is, uh, is user friendly, awesome setup, uh, big touch screen. Um, so what you're going to do in this case, uh, we'll get right into it, hit the gear in the bottom right hand corner. You're going to enter the current master user code. So the default master user code is 1111. So we'll go ahead and enter that here because I am using a default panel. At this point, you'll see a brand new menu populate. You want to go ahead and hit where it says users, and then you'll see a listing of all the codes that are currently programmed in the panel. So in this case, we, we're just going to go ahead and change the master code, and then I'll add another code after I've changed the master code. So to change the master code, you just go ahead and you hit this right here, and then uh, the, the little pencil on the right, and then it'll have a uh, regulatory statement. You have to agree to it. So uh, at this point, I'm going to go ahead and change the access code from 1111. Um, I'll just go ahead and put 1234. All right. And it makes you do it twice. Save it. At that point, I have changed the master code to 1234. I'm going to go ahead and add another user at this point. So if you need to add additional users, you would just go ahead and hit the add user button at the bottom. Then it'll ask you for the name. So we'll just put second in this case. Um, all right, and then hit next, and then we'll go ahead and put in 4321 for the code here. Go ahead and re enter it. All right, and then it'll ask you about facial recognition, which uh, we, we will have another video about. Um, I'm going to go ahead and skip that for now, uh, and I'm also going to skip the Bluetooth configuration. Um, that'll also be another video. But uh, at this point, the code has become configured. You can hit done and you will see all of your codes populate. Um, this is how you get a user code programmed in as well as changing your master code. So if you guys have any questions or you have any comments, please leave them below. Um, but at, uh, after you've uh, got this uh, code put in there, you just go ahead and hit the back arrow all the way out. It's, you hit it twice. Um, at this point, your codes are ready to be used. You can uh, you know, arm it. Um, in this case, we'll arm it in stay mode. And to test the code, we'll go ahead and hit disarm, and we'll go four, three, two, one, which was the code that we used uh, as our secondary code. Now we'll try it again. We'll hit arm stay, and this time I'm going to use the master code, which I changed to one, two, three, four. There we go. So the R codes work, and uh, at this point, you are good to go. You Make guys sure to subscribe to our YouTube page and click the show more tab underneath the video where you can view valuable links pertaining to this product, similar how-to videos, and our low-cost, no-contract alarm monitoring services.